All right, I'm live. Hello, everybody. Yeah, I'm gonna flip it in a second. I'll have you hold it. Um, I just wanna see if people, since I've never done this this way, I wanna see if I'm doing it right. I can always delete it too. But I just wanna see. Oh, okay, Jessica, hi. Hello, Jessica. So I know I promised you all that I would be trying this Japanese knotweed for my Lyme disease. Um, apparently it's even better than antibiotics. That's what I'm being told. Um, but let's see what we got here. I got 18 people, 21 people. Okay, let's keep going and let's get a bunch of people in here and I'm gonna actually pass the camera over. I don't worry, I'm not gonna be seen. I'm gonna pass the camera over, I'm gonna flip it so that Patrick can get me. So give me one second and figure this out, hold on. Okay, you're gonna have to read comments though. Okay. Hi everybody, me again. All right, so let me get my Japanese knotweed. So this is Japanese knotweed. This is what was recommended um, by one of my doctors that I take this. Um, he did say to mix it with something because it is really disgusting. And I'm kind of tempted to just try it on its own just to see, because it says, take it on its own. Take, uh, it says, serving size is uh, half a teaspoon, up to two times a day, all with food, but we just ate, so it should be good. Let me know if you see any questions, too. Not yet. Okay, so it is a very iconic herb, which is actually a pest and nuisance to gardeners and landscapers the world over holds a very magical secret within its leaves and vines. Tremendous amounts of transversitrol are in each serving, which is super potent antioxidant compound found to support healthy cholesterol levels and more. Uh, so let's see, uh, let me go get a cup. So take a look at that. You can read the packaging a little bit. And it says a half a teaspoon, so let's hope for the best. Any questions, anybody? Not so far, everybody's watching, but no question okay. yet. I don't know why I'm nervous. To try it? Yeah, I'm nervous to try it. The worst thing is not testing great. Hey, Jessica, she says hi to Patrick. Oh so. yeah, Patrick's here, he's recording. Yes. So that I can do this. Behind the scenes. He's for my, my, my behind the scenes, which is really just the kitchen. <laughs> Thermal right. leases, take care. So it's about a half a teaspoon. One teaspoon. Okay, we don't have a teaspoon. Tathos wants you. I said, no, you can't have me, Tathos. <laughs> Forget it, dude. <laughs> All right, we need. Hi, Gwenda. Uh, hi, Gwenda. Honey, we need to get new measuring spoons. Got you. Because that's a quarter. <laughs> Should we start with a quarter, maybe? Yes. Yeah? Just yes. To see? Jessica just wanted to hear my accent. That's cute. That's really oh, sweet. Yeah, really that's sweet of it. Ina says hi, Mackenzie. Hi, Ina. Ina. All right, so I've got this Tanya Japanese says... knotweed. Should I start with a quarter teaspoon? Hi, Tanya. Should I start? With... It says a half a teaspoon, which I start with a quarter. Honey? Good way. Yeah, start. Yes. Just to, like, I, mean, I don't know what my system is going to do. And guys, just so you know, and this is what poor Patrick has to deal with. I panic every time I have to take something because I don't know how I'm going to react to it. We don't. You never know. And I know we've been to all stuff, but still. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here goes. Let's do it. Oh, it's not smelling good. Oh, but it's great. Oh God, it smells like, you know, like when when people would smoke and they drop their cigarettes in water? Oh. They would sit there for like a couple days? Yeah. That's what it smells like. You got this girl, Jessica saying. Bottoms up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <coughs> it tastes like the cigarettes that have been sitting there for a couple of days. Have you tasted that before? I've never tasted it, but you know how your smell is connected to your taste buds? Got you. Gwena says <laughs> bottom ups, girl. <coughs> bottoms. bottoms up, girl. Okay, I can do this. This, <laughs> this is only the quarter. Alicia is laughing. Dugan. <laughs> oh, hey, Alicia. Alicia, that's Elijah. She's laughing at your Elijah, sorry. Everybody's like... Sorry, you guys have been like, wait, this is really bad. It's really bad. But it's it's heart healthy and it helps with Lyme disease. Maddox Tyler says, don't panic, Mackenzie, it's okay. Oh, hi, Maddox. You better be eating, young man. Oh, 
Okay. See, I'm doing my healthy part. You're gonna do your healthy part. You know, it's like you should scale to buy everything. Right? Thank you, Nina. <laughs> Glad you know I'm not alone. All right, here we go. I'm just gonna chug it. Shall I just chug it and just get it over with? You'll get used to it, uh, Theodore says. Oh. Everybody's supportive. Country says the same thing. Up, oh, up. Oh. <laughs> Should I call the the emergency? No. <laughs> chug. I'll call David. <laughs> Alicia says chug. Hello. <laughs> It's bad. Is it? It's really bad. Yeah, it's bad. But I think, um, like Drew, Drew is the one that had recommended mixing it with like a protein powder. I think that's what. Oh, you should have done. You should have mixed it. Well, I wanted to. I wanted to know the taste of it. I wanted Drink to orange juice, Elijah said. I don't know if you can mix it with an acidity like that. So I know protein powder it can be mixed with, but my God. All I can say, the only thing that I can relate it to is if you've ever smelled day old Wait, cigarettes. Wait, wine, wine just actually drank cigarettes ashes in water. He right. made a mistake. Wine just drank cigarette water with uh, cig cigarette water by mistake. No. <laughs> so we would be able to tell you how it tastes. Well, this is how it tastes. This is what I would imagine day old cigarettes in water sitting there in the heat just drink a lot of water to take the taste out of your mouth can't she say yeah, elijah is laughing she can't stop <laughs> this is really disgusting i can't blame her <laughs> you should see it from here from this <laughs> so maybe that was your experience yeah that's it so that's japanese knotweed powder guys um this is nature restore and it's nothing against nature restore apparently all japanese knotweed tastes like crap so this is nothing new or different i was warned of this um however this is apparently really really good for lyme disease so we shall see and i will show you more of the stuff that i am taking that has actually helped immensely this is just like the last piece of the puzzle that i needed to add in that i was putting off um but it's now done so that's it. Wine's funny is going on with the story of the cigarette water he drank from his wife in a mistake. Say so he'll never forget about it. So Okay, it's bad, right? Yes, I'm sure. I, I don't know what that tastes like, but if I were to drink cigarette water, this would have been it. Cool. Like even the, the aftertaste. It's very French of you. Very French of me <laughs> to drink cigarette water? That's right, because we all smoke cigarettes then. <laughs> I don't anymore. For, Not anymore. Forever, actually. Thank God, we wouldn't be together. And Gwenda is happy, she's hoping it works for you, which is the right thing I'm to say. I'm hoping it works too, because if I've got to drink this crap, then I, I hope it works, because it's really bad. One more shot at it, because I'm holding the camera, I'm like in charge of the filming. <laughs> I hope everybody's very impressed with this extreme, extreme camera, camera moves. Work. You know, I'm, I have a hard time doing it. I'm reading the, the words and I just can't, I'm you I'm, whatever. Like I'm gonna have to get used to this. You're gonna use I don't want to get used to it. What time did I take okay. it? So 4:30 I took it. So we'll just see. It's funny the color of your skin's changing slightly. Stop it. <laughs> that's not funny. Don't do that to me. The texture too. That's Stop wild. Stop it. That's not funny. <laughs> you know I panic about these things. Everybody hopes it's uh, it's gonna help. Oh, all right. Well, so what do we do? My, um, Japanese knotweed. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna show everybody my my array of, of supplements that I am taking right now. So I'm gonna flip the camera around. Okay. Worry, I won't flip it on you. Don't worry. That would be great. So I'm gonna flip it this way. Uh, where is the flip button? So we made mysterious. Yeah. Cool. All right. So I'm right here. Yes, you're mysterious. Don't worry. I'll keep it tight on me. Hey everybody. So that was my Japanese knotweed. Um, I'm going to show you some of the other stuff that I do take because I know I talked about doing a uh, video on you know, how I'm, how I'm getting through some of this. So I'm just going to turn this back around again. Here's actually on my floor because I had to lay it all out, all the different stuff I take. And this is actually just one piece. This is uh, one pack for PM, there's AM, and there is lunch. So I'm taking all this. I've been taking it for a couple weeks now. And to be honest with you, I am no longer having swollen joints. They're not red. Um, 
I'm, I'm actually doing doing good so far. And here you can see, here's even like the list of stuff. Licorice, Monolaurin, Ginseng, Depower, Inflamasooth. All these great things. And this is from David Allen Nutrition. So David, thank you. Oh God. All right. Let's hope this uh, Japanese not weed stuff works. Back to me in the dark. All right, everybody. So that was my live Japanese knotweed. Thank you for watching. And uh, I'll see you next time. At least you got to see the start of what I'm doing for um, my Lyme disease and how I'm handling it. And uh, yeah, God bless David Allen and Drew Prince, who are the two amazing doctors that are taking care of me through this. Um, and weirdly enough, I am starting to remember now uh, having a rash over the summer, having a, a bite. Uh, that I just thought was maybe like a giant mosquito. It smells bad. I love the smell, you dude. like the smell? Like, yeah. What? Really? I like the smell. Too. Well, you smoked. I never smoked. Oh, it doesn't smell. It smells. What does it smell like to you? It smells like a cool um, weed or something. Smells like weed? <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> great, honey. <laughs> It's not like a sort of weed, not the, not the no, oh, I thought <laughs> so. Some sort of weed is is what it smells it's, like it's to Patrick. Grassy, it's gr grassy. it's grassy. It's yes, smoky grass. that's it. Yes, it's a smoky grass. You're right. That that is kind of it. That's genius. That is genius. <laughs> not only are you hot in French, but you're genius. <laughs> He's leaving now. <laughs> He said, he, they, so Jessica said, he's French, and of course he does. Drink it, Patrick. <laughs> yeah, you drink it. If I gotta drink it, you should. It's apparently really good for everybody. It's not just a Lyme disease thing. It's apparently really good for everybody. So, yeah, you should. Try it. You want some? Seriously, do you wanna try it? Okay. Do you want the quarter like I did, or do you want the full half a teaspoon? You want to do the full? I just want you to try it just to see. You want to put a shirt on so I can film you? <sighs> okay, I'll just make it for you then. No, I'm gonna make it for you right now. Hold on. All right, let me put this here so you can. Um, if you buy this, you can get this actually on Amazon. That's where I bought it. So I'm gonna make another for Patrick, but he refuses to put a shirt on, so. can't videotape him. Sorry. All right, fill it with water. Fill the whole thing? No, 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 no. Not the whole thing, because trust me, you're gonna want to just chug it. I would say like half and stir it. Okay. <sighs> Ow. I'm gonna leave this up, Jordan, don't worry. You'll, you'll see the beginning. And I'll put this on my YouTube. So everybody, yeah, okay, stir it. Oh, I wanna watch Patrick really quick. Everybody, I'm gonna put this on my YouTube, so please be sure to go to my YouTube, Mackenzie Westmore, subscribe, watch. I'm gonna be putting tons of videos up on there. Um, and the reason why I wanted to start the Japanese Knotweed today is because I had a, 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 a kind of like a, what do you call it, a flare-up yesterday. So I wanna, I wanna watch him and see. Everybody's telling you to drink it like a shot. You got it, yeah, it doesn't dissolve easily. Maybe that's why he said, put it in like a blender. And? It doesn't bother me. What? No, it's okay, you can come out, it's fine. I'm on, no, you can come out though, you can walk around. It's, it's just a regular live, don't worry. I know, he's free, totally freaking out. So it's, a, it's not bad. Okay, it's Patrick likes it. But also, hey, I'm French with no stuff that you guys do. Okay, okay, oh, what's that supposed to mean? It means like we open to more tests. <laughs> really? No, but you know, we eat like snails and stuff. You guys eat stuff. Yeah, you eat crap. Exactly. So you're used to crap. Exactly. <laughs> we're French and we're open to more it things. It is a specific, unique taste. It is. It's a unique taste. It's specific. It is cigarette. Does it, okay, does it not kind of make you think of cigarettes and water? Yeah, you know, you know I'm not wrong, thank you. Okay, always remember we're here for you through thick and thin. Thank you, Gwenda. Hey, Jim. Hello, everybody joining. So Patrick and I both had Japanese knotweed. Um, he doesn't really need it, but I do. But he wanted to try it just to be supportive. Hi, Candace. 
Yes, I was Sheridan Crane Lopez Fitzgerald. So that's it guys, that is my Japanese nutweed and um, I'll come on more with more like homeopathic, more natural things that I'm doing, um, you know, more healthy things that I'm doing. Uh, it's just some more, more natural ways to help the body, heal the body. Um, I, I was diagnosed late with Lyme disease, however, I was too late for antibiotics, but I have opted to at least try uh, a more natural homeopathic route and um, apparently some of my uh, supplements and, and medications I was taking were too much and my body was going through something called hexing and that's what I went through yesterday. So if you watched my live with model pics, I, I actually need to apologize to him because I, I didn't get out of bed yesterday till 2 p.m. Uh, because it was a rough one and I haven't had that happen. Touch wood, it was just one time. Um, I didn't get a good night's sleep and I, my body was doing this hexing thing. So it's where the, it's where the body's killing off the virus. So, um, I'll bring more of this to you. I'll show you more of my home remedies and ugh, thank you for joining me. Again, go to my YouTube. I'm gonna put this up on there, um, Mackenzie Westmore, and you'll be able to find more videos to come. I love to you all. Bye everybody.